that uh, this inverter receive and send AC current in single phase. Receive hot, neutral, and ground, and send hot, neutral, and ground. In other words, each inverter, each of those inverters produce one phase. Look at this, short power is hot, hot, neutral, and ground. And this generator is hot, hot, neutral, and ground. No? Clear? Okay, in other words, the input from short and generator is double phase. My panel will be double phase, hot, hot, neutral, and ground. I have double breakers, double breakers, and in the bottom, I have single breaker. All right. However, each inverter produces only one phase. This is why I need two inverters in tandem, connected in a split phase. This is. This is the name of the procedure. Uh, what is the idea? Pay attention. This is the automatic transfer switch. This is the input from short power, and this is the input from generator. And this is the output to the inverters. To the inverters. I have hot, hot, neutral, and ground. Pay attention. With the hot number one, the black one, I am going to fit the input of the inverter number one. With the hot number two, the red one, I am going to fit the input of the second inverter. With the neutral, with the neutral, I am going to fit a small neutral boost bar, and from that neutral boost bar, I fit neutral here in that input, and neutral here in that input. Anybody follow me? With the ground, I am going to interrupt the ground, install the galvanic isolator. In the output of the galvanic isolator, I continue. I fit other small ground boost bar, one ground for this input, other ground for that input. That's okay? And now, the input of this is full, the input of this is full. This one is with the black face, and this one is with the red face. That's okay? And now, I am going to produce the output. Okay, this output produces the new red face, and this one produces the new, the new black face. Black face with this, and red face with this. Black and red enter in the AC panel, and I have two, I have two, two faces. One face is produced for this inverter, the other face is produced for that inverter. Pay attention to this. In the output of this and the output of this, I produce neutral and neutral. And I am going to create a neutral output, neutral output boost bar. And from that neutral, I am going to fit my neutral main breaker in the AC panel and the neutral boost bar in the AC panel. That's clear, guys? That's the secret. I'm going to repeat. I'm going to repeat slowly. Hot, hot, neutral, and ground coming from? Hot, hot, neutral, and ground coming from? Hot, hot, neutral, and ground produ produced in the output of the automatic transfer switch. Okay, with the hot number one, the black one, I am going to fit the input of the inverter number one. With the hot number two, the red one, I am going to fit the hot number two in the second inverter red color. With the neutral, I am going to create a small neutral boost bar at in input, neutral boost bar, and I am going to provide input for this input, for this inverter, and neutral for this inverter at the input. That's okay? For both of them, okay. because that neutral is coming here. Anybody follow me? Yeah. With the ground, follow me. With the ground, I am going to interrupt the ground, install the galvanic isolator, continue here, create a small ground boost bar to provide ground at that input and ground at that input. And now, in the output of this, 
output and output, I produce other ground, and I produce other ground, and that other ground will be here, and that ground bus bar will be the ground of the AC panels, and that ground bus bar will be connected with the bonding conductor, and the bonding conductor will be connected with the, the sacrificial anode in the output of the bulb. And uh, this is the procedure to connect a split phase. Now I have two phases, two phases, one phase coming from this inverter and the second phase coming from the second inverter. And now the rest is easy because it's, uh, I want to connect this one and I am going to provide power here to the first breaker and this and this, no guys? Yes. And in the second one, I am going to connect this one and I am going to provide here and here and here and here. Ah, okay, but here I provide power over there and with this I provide power here for that one and bye bye, I have double breakers and I have neutral and I have ground and this is my split phase. The only part that is critical is that input neutral and that output neutral. The input neutral is coming from the neutral here in the transfer switch. And the output neutral is coming from the neutral created for each inverter and that neutral is the neutral entering in the AC panel. Good, Papas? Difficult? Yes. 